Thanks for logging on to MyFoxHurricane.com. I'm Jim Weber with your tropical update. So through the month of October, the areas that we really start to watch is across the Caribbean, the Gulf of Mexico, the Western Atlantic, and right on cue, we've had two tropical systems you know, forming in the Caribbean. We have Tropical Storm Gamma, which was in the Caribbean over the weekend, worked its way over the Yucatan. Now, as you look at this system, you can tell this is obviously not a well-defined system. You've got the center right on the tip of the Yucatan. All the convection is way to the north, so that strong wind shear has basically just sheared this system apart, but somehow it still has winds of 45 miles an hour. It's just going to continue to drift around, currently drifting to the south-southwest at two miles an hour and weaken over the next several days, bringing some gusty winds and some rain across the Yucatan Peninsula as we go through the next couple of days. But here is the one that we really have to watch. This is now Tropical Storm Delta. Right now, winds are at 45 miles an hour. It's moving to the west at seven. So this is moving over area with warm water. We have light wind shear. We have light wind shear in its forecast over the next several days. So these are all things that this system would like to see for additional development. In fact, uh, we are calling for this to become a hurricane. And at this point, it looks like this could become a category two hurricane. And obviously at this point, category three is not out of the question. It'll be moving across warm Gulf waters. It won't be until it gets across the Northern Gulf of Mexico that you start to see some cooler waters and maybe some wind shear starting to pick up over this system. But again, we're talking about the same area across the Northern Gulf of Mexico all season long. It's been Louisiana, it's been Mississippi, it's been Alabama and the Western Panhandle that has basically been watching each one of these systems uh, heading in. And again, this is where Tropical Storm Delta at that point looks like Hurricane Delta will be going. Very good agreement at this point between the European and the GFS. You're seeing a little bit of a timing difference, but the basic idea is it still has it going to the same place. The GFS may be just a little bit slower in its forward motion arriving on the coastline just a tad bit later, but still very good agreement between these computer models. So we're going to continue to watch this and we'll keep you updated right here on myfoxhurricane.com.